Hey guys, welcome back to Salem Cellar. We are going to be comparing some eyewear. Key Australia versus designer brands. Wait and see. But please make sure you are following me on social media and you like, share, and subscribe. I'll be right back. So as a lover of sunglasses and designer glasses, throughout the years, I've bought, it's embarrassing to say, probably hundreds of pairs of sunglasses and just love my designer shades. But as a mom of two small kids, I need to budget. I can't be buying Gucci's and Burberry's all the time. So my sister was over for Christmas and she was talking about her new Key Australia sunglasses. And then she told me the price and I'm like, I don't know if I want to spend $55 on a pair of sunglasses that are, that's not designer. If I'm going to spend that much, I might as well get a designer pair. Plus I was worried about the quality, you know, when you just buy a cheap pair of sunglasses in the store, they just break within a few days. And my son, with him grabbing everything I have, I can't have anything flimsy in the house. So I tried on her pair and I'm like, okay, this might be something worth giving a try. So the brand is called Key Australia. It's spelled Q-U-A-Y, but it's pronounced Key, which I was saying Quay for a while. So I ordered the same exact pair she had, which was the Come Through. It is the Black Fade and oh boy so i have a very round face and these glasses just made me feel like okay like even when i'm not all done up and i don't have makeup on i throw these shades on and i'm just like okay i feel I feel good about myself today so these are the come through you might see little fingerprints. I've worn them a bunch of times. It's a little of a cat eye, which I love cat eye. Anything dramatic, but not flimsy at all. They feel like the real deal. Like I, I fell in love with them immediately, immediately. I didn't expect to, I was like $55. I actually purchased these when they were having a BOGO deal. So it's not the BOGO, buy one, get one half off. That to me is not BOGO. BOGO is buy one, get one free. And the second pair was free. So there's actually the deal going on right now, the BOGO deal. I'll put the Key Australia link down below so you can check it out. So if you're watching this video months from now, I can't guarantee the BOGO is gonna still be going on, but they do have to sale a lot. They have it going on now. I think a few months ago they had it or on Christmas they had it. So if you are have their notifications going, like if you get their emails regularly, I'm sure you're going to come across it in a, like a few weeks from now if it's not currently going on when you while you watch this. So I'm going to try these on. Oh my goodness. I, I just don't, I don't know if you can even like get how amazing these are from like, they're just everything to me. The fade, whew, I just, I fell in love with the fade right away, but so cute. So I'm gonna do an unboxing of two other pairs that I bought. I haven't tried these on yet. And then we're going to compare them to some designer ones that I bought. I have a pair of Burberry's that I bought from Sunglass Hut. So just compare the two. The come throughs, I, I love. Like I fell in love immediately but I bought these high key black fade. So it comes in a package like this. And they do come in case with cases. You can buy different types of cases, but it does come with this clear case. You can see, super cute. That's the key right there. That's how it's spelled. So let's see. They do package these really well. And the shipping was pretty fast. I was just, I was worried it was gonna take a while. But it comes with a little cleaning cloth. Let's see. So these are aviators. 
I'm not a pretty big aviator girl, but I just wanted something different. I have a lot of cat eyeglasses. I'm like, well, let me try it out. Let's switch it up. Okay. I should have probably taken these off before. I'm struggling. Okay, got it off. <laughs> so these are these have the black fade, just like the come through. My hair keeps on like itching my face. So let's try these on. All right, so yeah, this is everything. They don't feel cheap. They just feel like a regular pair of aviators. They're not super thick. They don't feel flimsy to me, but they're so cute. Oh, hello. Hello. <laughs> no, but I, I like these. I like these a lot. I'm a fan. They do have the mini one. So if you're not a fan of like really big oversized glasses, go for the mini. I just have a big round face. So I, I need big glasses. So I approve of these aviators. Let's go into the other. I'm making a complete mess over here. Okay, so these are the Hindsight. They're black, smoke green, and they are faded. I just have a feeling I'm going to love these. I stared at them online for a while. I'm like, like I saw the other girls wearing them on Instagram and all over. I'm like, can I pull those off? I was definitely worried that I wasn't going to be able to, but whatever well, let's see what's the worst looks terrible on me then oh well they were free i got a bogo so okay so this is the green fade i don't know if you can really see it there's a little you see my the light from my camera stand but there is a subtle green fade it's not anything like you're not gonna look like a ninja turtle walking around with it it's very subtle so let's, let's try these bad boys on oh oh hello hello there Carmela oh so yeah I'm buying these in every color these are cute these are really cute and they feel like my come throughs like they're really thick like the aviators of course were a little not didn't feel as sturdy and thick but these feel really good on my face I like they have them in a pink fade they have, they have so many different color fades that now I want to like go back online and look at it them since they're currently having the BOGO, but I am a fan. I'm a fan. I like these a lot. So you don't have to be an Instagram model to look good in, in Key's sunglasses. I just f figured that out right now. All right. So I want to compare my Burberry sunglasses from sunglass hut let's see like was it worth all that money i paid or can i just buy my sunglasses from key going forward i haven't tried these on yet all right so comes in this really cute burberry case leather thick solid what else do you expect from burberry so i really loved these because as you can see, the Burberry print, I just, uh, I just thought that was cute. It has a little bit of a cat eye, nothing too crazy. I usually like more dramatic cat eyes. Let's see if these are cute. Oh, yeah. See, these, to me, these feel like the same quality as the Keys. They feel just as thick and comfortable in my face. They're cute. I don't know if I'm like loving them as much as those, but I do like them. All right, so we tried on our designer and we tried on our key and I have to go with key. I, I, I really just love them. Like the Burberrys were beautiful and I'm going to keep them and wear them <laughs> a lot, but the keys I just really loved. So to spend $55, like they range from $50 to I think $65. They also have blue light glasses. So if you're staring at your phone a lot, like I am, or a computer screen, uh, then why not give them a try? I think I'm going to purchase a pair of blue light to see if that helps. Um, but yeah, why not get BOGO? <laughs> like what else can I say? Like buy a pair, get another one free, give one as a gift. 
I, the key, key glasses win it for me. So I'm going to put the style of glasses and the links down below. Let me know which one your favorite was and if you've ever tried key or show your sunglasses. And like always, make sure you are following me on social media. We could be friends. <laughs> like, share, and subscribe. And I'll be right back.